Yeah, I, I mean, we asked a lot of a lot of guys to try and help us win that game, and uh, that was that was at least a good thing. As we did have a few guys come off the bench and execute for us. Steve Seda did a good job coming off the bench, um, in particular, and then Andy Almquist was really good to you know we, we went out the, we left him out there for a while, and he kept up putting up zeros uh, until we could finally scratch one across. So um, as much as it, it wasn't pretty, that was a, a team win. Uh, where a lot of guys contributed to it, so I'll, I'll and I'll we'll, we'll take wins right now. Talked about trying to get some guys going a little bit. I know Tom Kelly's come in. You were happy with what he did last week in some appearances. Uh, Spencer came in today. Other bullpen looked pretty good. Just tell me about some of those guys you're looking to step up and maybe what they've done so far yeah. this week. The big one for me, not Tom Kelly's. I mean, he had a great at bat. I think to take the lead or to tie it, where I mean that had to be a 10-11 pitch at bat, where he finally gets the single through the left side. That was great. Uh, Spencer Mraz is someone we're going to have to lean on. Um, he's he's got to keep coming. He's got to, and I think some of it's just between his ears. He's got to start thinking he's really good because he is talented, um, and, and he's and he's tough. You know, he's a guy you want with the ball. Uh, but the big one this week is is Grant Hartwig swinging the bat. I mean, he he's he he looks good up there, and that's that's somebody that uh, it's good to know that we've got an option if he's not if he's not hitting that game, if he's not in the lineup that day, that we got a really good option coming in off the bench, which is what how I kind of wanted to uh, to get him going anyways. But if he keeps swinging the bat this well, we might just have to put him in there and and, and let him go. I imagine Landon Stevens is probably in that conversation as well with a pretty good games the last couple of days. Yeah, Landon Landon's starting to slow things down. I think uh, for, for a few of these guys, and we still we still got a couple guys fighting too. Um, but but kind of learning not to be freshmen anymore. You know, a few of these guys we're 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 playing quite a few freshmen, and Cal Elvers is starting to slow it down a little bit. Landon's starting to slow it down a bit. Um, Grant Hartwig's had some success offensively and on the mound. Um, still working on some guys too, though. We're still trying to get J.T. Stone and 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 Will Vogel saying to uh, to just take some deep breaths every now and then and, and trust that they're really good and all the hard work they put in. So that, that's just part of the process, though. But um, Landon for sure is 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 really stepping up his game. When you win an ugly game like that, what do you say to the guys? Obviously, it's exciting to get the walk-off winner, but what's the message afterwards? Well, I think for me today, the the message is is just pointing out the, a couple things that I really liked, and, and the biggest one is Spencer Dahl, who. I, I don't think he's gotten a start in probably six games. Um, behind, he's behind the plate tonight, and I bet. I mean, he blocked 15 or 20 balls with guys on third base. That if, if he lets up on one of those, we lose the game. I think, and, and he did a great job. Uh, it takes no talent to, to block a baseball, but it takes you got to be tough every time, and you can't you can't be lazy for a second. You can't be lazy one pitch. And uh, he did a great job of that today, and that's something that you know I, I pointed out to our guys is that was a, a, a tough guy we had behind the plate all game, and I think he really helped us win the baseball game. Not to mention he did have a, a, a big RBI uh, single for us too, but um, I think I think that was a huge reason why we won that game is because we had the Spencer behind the plate doing a great job for us.